Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today is another amazing collab with another beautiful, wonderful person. My beautiful soul sister, sister from another mister, and Bridget. You will find Bridget's channel and her video linked in the description box below. Please, please go check her out if you haven't already. Um, you'll see a couple of photos, I believe, somewhere floating around my head. Um, Bridget loves colourful makeup and we decided to do a collab. Um, we were thinking about what palettes we had in common and then Bridget mentioned these two. So the Sweet, I should say Beach Cosmetics Sweet Shop Cherry on Top and the BH Cosmetics Sweet Shop Pistachio and yeah this is the look I came up with um I can't wait to see what Bridget does before we jump in I do need to mention these earrings they are from Lois Cosmetics they came as a free gift with purchase I don't know how well you can see their little reindeer I love them love them so yeah <laughs> If you would like to see how I created this look and hear a bit more about Bridget, then yeah, just keep on watching. Okay guys, so I have primed my eyes with the ABH eye primer. If I'm sniveling a lot, I'm sorry. Um, I'm not feeling my best. Um, but anyways, that aside, <laughs> um, I'm first going to go into the Sweet Shop Cherry on Top palette. And... I'm going to take sprinkles and I'm taking that on a Spectrum A12. It's actually my first time using this palette. Um, I've used both the bubblegum and the pistachio before, but yeah, first time using cherry on top. Um, it was actually Bridget who suggested, because we were trying to work out what palettes we had in common to collab with and it was Bridget suggested these two because obviously red and green they're Christmassy colours and we both love the BH Cosmetics formula so yeah and performs the same as the other side so what can I tell you about Bridget well if you're not new you will already know who Bridget is we have collabed before um, we collabed, um, we did a three-way collab with also Marina, who I will also link in the description box below with Bridget. Um, so you'll find Bridget's channel and her video linked in the description box below. Please go check her out if you haven't already. Um, excuse me. <laughs> um, Bridget is just one of the just most kind-hearted, wonderful people. She is, what you see is what you get. She is hilarious. I'm always, I always come away laughing. Um, and she also does lives on Facebook. And believe me when I say her channel is... Well, her household is just a barrel of laughs. Uh, she has two beautiful dogs. Bridget is a lady after my own heart. Um, in the over 40s category also. And a lover of colourful makeup. It's funny that we're using red and green for our collab because red is Bridget's colour and green is mine so it's quite fitting that these are the colours we are using to collab with BH really just do a fantastic job with their palettes um, I do need to give the absinthe one another shot because uh, I used it in my Common Comedian Live and I wasn't that impressed but I also was in a lot of pain and not necessarily feeling my best so 
I will be giving that another go because it's green and if you know me you know I love greens right now speaking of greens we are moving over to the pistachio palette and I'm going into Conal Cup so if you haven't already guessed I'm just going to be doing kind of an opposites eye look if that makes sense um I haven't done one like this in a long time but I'm looking forward to it Yeah, Bridget is another lover of a lot of the same brands that I love and just the same colourful vibe. And like I said, just a really, really wonderful person. And her two dogs are so freaking cute. They are adorable. And they... They have made appearances in a couple of videos. But yeah, I just, I love Bridget so much. She is like my sister from another mister. And she is really getting back on her feet now because she was so poorly. She had COVID and uh, there was more to it than just the COVID, but just going back in with that brush to just turn those edges a bit more. But yeah, she was really, really poorly, bless her. And that woman is a fighter through and through. Right, next up. Ooh, what one do I want to go in with? I'm going to go in with... Tarte from the Cherry on Top palette. I'm I'm going to stop saying the names of the palettes because the green one is the pistachio, the red one is the cherry on top. So yeah, <laughs> I'm going in with Tarte's and I'm using this brush from Odin's Eye from the Freya collection. It's the FR2 and I've got hair attached to my arm that's tickling me. Um, These brushes are amazing. Just FYI and I'm going to take that that is not as red as I thought oh it's pretty though it is pretty um I've completely forgotten what I was saying now completely oh yeah Bridget was <laughs> oh I do apologize Bridget was so so poorly um it was a real worry and I have never known someone so resilient. She is just, she has the, just this attitude to life that I think you kind of need these days, especially in the times we're in um, with the, I'm not going to mention it, the, the thing that shall not be named. We're going to call that. Ooh. This is pretty. Don't get too carried away, stuff. <laughs> oh dear. Right, I'm junk. Junk. I'm just going back in with sprinkles. And I'm just going to kind of reinforce it, but then drag it ever so slightly into the crease there. And kind of up and into tart. Bridget also posts a lot on Instagram, a lot of looks that she does. Um, she's on a bit of a roll at the moment with looks, both Instagram and YouTube. I've noticed another one has gone up for me throughout the night. Um, I haven't had a chance to watch it yet because I am filming. Um, and I wanted to because I could feel that I was getting progressively worse pain. I say pain wise, I think my tolerance of the pain is lowering because I'm not feeling good. Um, so yeah, I wanted to make sure I got this filmed before I become incapable 
or doing anything because I didn't feel that coming today. Oh my word, that is beautiful. That is so beautiful. Yes, I am not as resilient as Bridget. <laughs> there goes my phone. That is perfect. Right, and now. Excuse the snivelling. <laughs> now I am going to go in with Nutty. And I'm taking that on this Lois Cosmetics brush. These brushes are amazing also. Highly recommend them. Um, so yeah, we're going to uh, pop this here. But Bridget does a lot of um, lives on Facebook also and they're just a bunch of fun just always so much fun I don't think you could ever come away from like spending time with Bridget feeling unhappy it just wouldn't be possible she's just wonderful just wonderful um don't have the words And then back in with Conal Cup, and just to make sure we haven't lost that. I'm just doing the same as I did on the other eye, just with these shades. Okay, I am not mad at this at all. And just re-intensify it right down in the crease there. Uh, in the crease, the outer V. So I'm just going to, for this side, take Soft Serve on a Morphe and Madison Beer Fluffy brush. And I'm just going to use that just ever so gently on the edge just to make sure that we haven't got a harsh line. It's just kind of blended out nicely. Yeah, if you can get hold of these pipes, I don't know if they're still selling them. If they are, if you can get hold of them, they are so worth it. They are just beautiful. I only have four of them. I have the cotton candy, the bubble gum, the pistachio and the cherry on top. I'm not sure which ones Bridget's got, actually. I know, obviously, she's got these ones because they're the ones we're collabing with but yeah seriously guys Bridget is awesome she is so lovely and I love collabing with her so much I'm just going to bring that up slightly and then go back in with the middle brush That is it's looking so good. And then, and then, on A. Oh, on A. And then, I'm going to go in with Sunday. And I'm taking that on a Moda, I think it says crease brush. Um, just to blend out this side. Yeah, these, these shadows are really something else. They are kind of high, high end quality and lower end prices. Does that make sense? They're very affordable, I, I believe. That's beautiful. And back in with the middle one. And 
Okay, I'm just going to quickly pop some NYX Glitter Primer on my lids. Just because I haven't done for a while. Is it possible to miss something like that? So I am first going in with Crunch and I am taking that on this Soeva 234 Lux Smoky Shader. And I am taking that right, right on this outer part here. Crikey, we're looking Christmassy already, see? Look at that. Beautiful. These shades are just oh, absolutely amazing. Obviously my favourite is the pistachio um, because yeah I'm, I'm a huge green fan. I'm not worried about underneath my eye any fallout because uh, that doesn't matter. Right and then on a going to town today um, then I am next going to go in with black cherry this shimmer there and I'm going to do the same as with the other side I might have gone even further in with that oops it's all good, it's all good. Yeah, see that we're looking Christmassy already. Love it. Love it. Just gonna nip back in with the uh, green crunch just because I feel I've kind of taken that not up high enough if that makes sense there we go so for the inner part I'm going in with sweet life and I am taking that on a Lois Cosmetics little flat brush and I'm just going to pack that oh I love this shade so much just look at that beautiful is that and then I'm just gonna drag it over crunch I'm loving this oh I can't wait to see what Bridget does, how she will combine the two palettes. I wonder if we've had the same idea. Oh, it's so good, so good. Right, and then on to this side. I am going in with Juicy. Pop one there. Or am I? Oh. Yeah, I am. No, I'm not. Yeah, I am. Right, I am going in with Juicy. No, I'm not. Change of plan, change of plan. It's not quite as light as I thought. So I'm going in with Sweet. What is wrong with me, eh? 
At least I'm not having to try and do exactly the same on both eyes. <laughs> oh, look at that. Yeah. Honestly, guys, these, the quality of these shadows is just phenomenal. I adore them. I'm so happy that this is what um, Bridget suggested we collab with. Because, yeah, I just haven't picked this palette up to use yet, just because I have so much else to kind of film with. It kind of got caught in the, the pile of stuff that, yeah, I need to film with. I love the look of that. Right, I'm going to quickly dip in with Sprinkles, the deepest red matte. And I'm just going to see if I can just make it so that there's not such a harsh line. I'll do and then the same the same on the other eye I think actually we've lost that red a bit I'm just going to dip back in to the cherry on top palette the deepest of the shimmers and I'm just going to go back in and just tap that into the lighter shade and into that green matte a bit yeah that's better I'm loving how that's looking all right guys I'm going to nip off and finish my face I will come back to show you the finished look and have a quick chat so if you would like to see that then <laughs> don't go anywhere okay guys so i'm back with the finished look let me know what you think in the comments section below i cannot wait to see what bridget has done i wonder if we have done the same so i will let you know what else i've done a few bits um everything i've used will be listed in the uh in the description box below for you to check out um but under this eye i went in with conal cup and then i went in with a bit of nutty and a bit of guilty pleasure and then for the where am i at the shimmer under this eye i used treat and i just thought it looked beautiful and then for this eye um i went in with sprinkles and then a bit of tart and then i used juicy and i'm so happy with how it turned out i'm i'm loving it um my highlighter i used for the inner corner brow bone highlight as well as my face and it is from Yvette Beauty. It is in the shade Frost. And I love it. It's just perfect Christmas sparkle. I love it all year round. But perfect Christmas sparkle. And just for transparency. I did receive this in PR. I believe this is the only thing. Yes. Um, the mascara is from She Glam. It is this um, double ended one. It's volume and length and it is amazing i i'm speechless um i didn't feel the need to put on falsies today um to be fair i'm not feeling very well anyway so if i could escape the extra effort i was gonna do that so this is perfect i highly highly recommend it um this is my second time using it usually i wouldn't recommend a mascara this quick but Proofs in the pudding, guys. Um, in my waterline is another newfound favourite. It is one of the um, multi-chrome 
eyeliners from is it chroma chroma liners um from she glam and it's in the shade zenith and it is such a beautiful multi-chrome i thoroughly thoroughly enjoy it and for my lips i primed them with the colourpop lippy sticks primer it's amazing i i love that and then my lipstick i thought the perfect christmas lip it's from artichoke cosmetics from the born from the ashes collection and it's in the shade inferno and i think it screams christmas so yeah guys if you are over here from bridget's channel a hi welcome um i'm a huge lover of colorful makeup as you can probably tell um i love to support indie brands and i only use cruelty free products is there anything left to say no um bridget thank you so much for collabing with me i love you to bits you know that um this has been so much fun great choice to choose these two palettes by the way great choice i thoroughly enjoyed it and i cannot wait to see what you've done so guys if you've liked this video please give it a like um if you are new and you haven't subscribed already then i would really appreciate it if you would stick around um if you like to see lots of colorful makeup and indie brands large and small um yeah that's what i'm about guys so if that sounds good to you please do hit the subscribe button and thank you all for spending this time with me today i hope you're all having a great day great evening wherever you are and whatever you're doing i hope you're taking care of yourselves i will see you again very very soon goodbye